Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, where today I'm finally, after a long time, or for a little while, I don't know how long it's quite been, I'm finally going to do part number 21 to my iPad and tablet gameplay series. I don't know if I was spoiling this in the last video or not, guys, because, like I said, it's been a while since I've done that last video. But, honestly, guys, it, what may start happening is the fact that you won't see another video of this for, like, a few weeks after I make the next one. Like, this episode may go up right now, which, as you see what I date on the screen, I was explain why it was different and why it's also this. But before I do, as you can see the date on the screen, it's the 13th of October, 2019. And I don't remember quite when I did my last video. I, was, I think I remember in the last video talking about like how the series was coming kind of like to a bad start. Like when we started the series, it was going like in a like in a slope. Like it was going, say this was a hill. It started kind of like going. But then this is basically what it is at now. Well, not this ain't what it is at now. At some point during the series, something hit, something happened like a plane crash and not to start going way down. And basically that's how the series has been going the entire time. That plane may have hit it in like part, God, probably part 15, 14, 13. Well, now here's the thing. When we first started the series, it was all right. It was kind of going uphill and all right. But then, whenever I start adding the wheel, like the little random wheel to decide whether what the boss I'm doing next, the iPad or tablet game plays, Deciding what device I'll do out of all of that, it kind of like went up, started going higher and higher and higher. So that's where the wheels start, it started becoming a lot funner. But then around the highest peak of that, the plane crash. And down goes the spiral. Um, basically, what I mean by that is this series may actually come to a close at one point in time. Because the problem is. I'm running out of games that's entertaining me for this series. We still got one game that's holding us up, but like I'm still trying to get more time to get it done. That Pony City game where like you have to wait several days just to evolve your animals. Right now I've got like 665 of those things. But if I continue waiting, we can probably have over a thousand. And also guys, my, my main concern with that series, one thing about that series that's going to make it fun it's also the fact that like we'll have a lot of gems to do a lot of stuff with. Like we can go in there and grow as many dragons as we want to, basically, and talk totally run out of things. Generally, I like to grow all the baby ones first because those are the ones that are, like ain't gonna cost much. They don't cost anything at all. Um, but like I said, if I get a lot of gems, I can do a lot more of the already evolved guys. In fact, I think one time I don't remember when it was, but I remember like. About a month ago or so, I actually got rid of what like, the fire look at Earth dude. You know, the guy that counts at the Earth dude with the trees on his back and stuff and stuff. The trees and all that have like this big old live looking thing to him. That's basically what I did. I got rid of him and then Bree got him back. I'm trying to know how to do that with the other animals. That way we don't eventually lose anything to do. My main goal with the series is to try to get all the animals to evolve. But the big problem is, the game kind of has a glitch in it where, like, you guys know the little bow system that goes along with it. If you don't know, there's a little bow system that goes along with the Pony City game. But instead of you, like, bowing with the dragons you've already got, you're actually playing a little puzzle. And if you can beat that puzzle, uh, you can get rewards. Unfortunately, I've gotten to battle 100. And it won't let me go any further. But... I can go to level 99 and get a little bit of food and coins. Ain't gonna be new as much as I would normally get, but I still get it. Get it. So maybe like every few, like every few months or so or whatever, before I, if I haven't already went back to the series or went back to that game specifically, I might go on there and try to get a lot more coins and all that way. That way when I'm evolving the animals, I can actually get on to the next level. My main goal is just to have over at least a. Around a thousand stuff because, like, if I keep it at 600, we'll have a lot to do, yes. But the videos go by so quickly with just that. And, like I said, with that downhill spiral now that's actually happening, we're running out of games to do. 
we're on, we're in so much bad luck right now that we've already got all like five or six games on one device, and on the other device we have nothing. We were really down to one device, and because of that, I'm not really going to be doing much for this episode. Um, if the episode gets dragged out, it's only because of the fact that I'm spending so much time on one game or decide, hmm, okay, that didn't last too long, let's spend more time on this game specifically. I used to have a lot of games on there, but like I said, guys, I'm trying to find ones that will stay entertaining. So it's kind of just kind of boarded me out. We do got one new game on there that has a real good possibility of being on here. And it's because it's a pretty good game where you actually get to raise a whole bunch of different animals, but one of the main ones you get to raise is dragons. Um, so yeah. Like I say, I'm sorry for the downhill spiral that is going on with this series, but like I said, one day the series... Y'all don't really watch this series anyway. If y'all enjoy the series, I actually do what... what who, Whoever watches and likes this series, that's great. But I know y'all remain interested as in like regular Let's Go Pichu and Eevee and um, Pokemon Bow Revolution. Like I said in my last Pokemon Bow Revolution episode, I will be starting to go into a point where I'll, that's all I'll be doing for the videos. You know how in the last two videos of Pokemon Bow Revolution I've only been doing Courtyard Coliseum? I've explained this way too much, but I do gotta let you know that I think from now on during Battle Revolution, unless I can figure out a way to restart, not restart it, but still get anywhere in the Coliseums, we, that may be all we can do. Because the thing is, every time I try to do the Waterfall Coliseum now, I can't put Frogger in because the Pokemon are too hard to beat. And so, like, if Frogger thinks, that's immediately gonna make me upset. I care about my Pokemon's health. Honestly, more than you guys can probably comprehend, because I, I take better care of a Pokemon than I do myself. That's pretty bad, and I love a Pokemon. Like, ones that I actually do love are ones that I too would take care of, and if I had one as a friend or a pet in real life, I'd do the same thing. Like, you guys know how I care so much about for Alligator. One thing about the Courtyard Coliseum is, like I said in, in that episode, it starts out very easy and then gets more difficult. And if you remember the last episode of PBR, or Pokemon by Revolution, um, we had a run where Frogger had zero losses. Zero. And, he had like over 40 wins. So you see why I like to that one Coliseum? It's because of the fact that, and that's probably going to be the only Coliseum from now on where we're going to be able to end up with Frogger at zero losses and a bunch of wins. As you remember in the last episode as well, when, when I, I kind of predicted my own future in the beginning of the last episode of that game. Because in the beginning I was like, usually this game doesn't start getting, or the core call seems doesn't start getting hard to like battle 30. But if you leave it about like 33 or 34, I lost. Well, I didn't lose, but like we were in a bad position where Froggy was the only one left. And like I said, I'm trying to keep him from fainting at all. And plus I believe it was also a bad tight matchup, so. Wouldn't have been very safe to try that. But, when I did the second run of that game, we got to battle 50 and beat it. Which, surprisingly, was a lot more easier than it was the first time. Because the first time we faced battle 50 with Kruger, he was, his chance he had was like on steroids. Because, even with a focus blast, it did like that much. Nothing at all. I had to use like a bunch of other different attacks in order for it to work out in my favor. I'm still trying to kind of debate whether I'm going to do with both the Frogator and uh, Torterra Pass. Well, no, the two Frogator Passes that I have. As you guys remember, I have two passes with Frogator that with different moves. On um, one pass, he knows Ice Fang, Return, um, Waterfall, and Dig. On uh, the other one, he knows Ice Fang, Crunch, Hydro Cannon, and... Uh, Ice Fang, Crunch, Hydro Cannon. And I believe Focus Blast or something was the other one. I can't quite remember the last move. But the thing is, with that one, it's a lot more dangerous for us because Frogger has a lot better chance of fainting. Because that's when I got, even though Waterfall ain't taking the Pokemon out immediately on some occasions, it's still safe to know that like Frogger doesn't have to re-rest like on the next turn. 
Plus, the good thing with Warfall is it's better for him because it has it's a physical move. As you guys know, his physical attack is way higher than the special. And along with that, he doesn't have to rest on the next turn. So, like, he can use the move and then you can go again right after. And what's even better is it has a chance of flinching. Um, so yeah. That's one thing about Barry which I've really noticed. And, uh, yeah. So like I say, guys, I am sorry for just doing that one Colosseum specifically. But I'm trying to do a bunch of videos where, like, no more people are getting hurt. You might be thinking, okay, why don't you just restart and go Waterfall Colosseum again? No. No. After the torture in the Sunset Coliseum, I don't ever want to restart the game again. I'll be good. I'll be good just doing the Queer Coliseum. One thing about the Queer Coliseum also is that I seem to get really far into it, and by the time I get done, like as you guys know, yesterday or in the last video of this game, um, in the last video, I did the one Coliseum and got to like thirty, about thirty four, thirty three. And it took me like an hour, almost two hours. But then I redone it and got to about 50. And by the time I was done with that, it's been five hours. And plus, also, it gets more entertaining as it goes on as well. Because like I said, it just gets harder and harder and harder. Like the most important I've seen, our, seen everybody have is four. But as you guys remember, uh, in a previous video I made about maybe a week and a half ago, two weeks ago, maybe three weeks ago. Um, there was a run where I met all the way to about 73, 74. And, uh, was still going strong. Well, up until, like I said, about 73 or 74. One thing I've also noticed is that the last ball I did in the last video, the one with Kruger, his pulling was not nearly as hard as they were the first time. One of my main concerns nowadays is the fact that, like, like, one reason why I'm still doing another Coliseum is because in the past, I think this is a video I deleted, but in the past, I've done episodes where we'll be in a certain, certain coliseum oh, via magma, uh, waterfall, stuff like that, and we end up in a horrible position. Um, I remember one video I believe I deleted was an episode where I was going to the magma coliseum and there was a bunch of fire and dragon types, right? Get this. One of the type, one of those Pokemon, I believe it was a Magma or something, had Energy Ball. And guess what the announcer said? Energy Ball hits, which means it took him down. For all yours out at the time, I didn't know he had Energy Ball. So when I saw it, I was like, oh no. And then it went Energy Ball hits, and for all went down. You guys don't understand this. I have too much of a heart for a Pokemon. One that I love to death is one that I really take care of. Like how in Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee, I get that same exact team of Eevee or Pikachu, Nidoking, Charizard, Squirtle, Venusaur, and Lapras. It's because out of all the Pokemon you can catch in Gen 1, those are the Pokemon I like the best. And for you guys that don't know, I create a team based on who I like in the game. So if there's like six Pokemon I know I like that's in this game, you can bet money I'm going to grab them. That's why my old Pokemon Sun project that I did like a few months back, I collected me, I kept getting me a Bagon. Because if you guys don't know, Bagon's another one of my favorite dragon types. Just like how in the Sinnoh Pass of the Battle Revolution game, I've got Garchomp. Garchomp is like one of the best dragon types to me and I really love him. Um, but yeah... Anyway, guys, I've been spending almost 15 minutes talking about that. Before I actually do get started, though, I'm going to talk about all this new features up here, or what's going on up here. If you guys that don't know, um, I did change the settings in my UCAM. Not many settings have been changed. One setting I did change was the color of, like, the webcam itself. Because here's the thing. Whenever I have this camera up, it always shows up with like a, like a kind of, a, I don't know what the color would be, but like a different color than what it is now. For you guys that don't know, there's a little setting 
inside the little settings tab I can go to and it'll let me change the color of the like webcam itself. You can't see it right now, but like as I'm as I'm recording, which like I said this won't show up on video, so don't worry about that. There's these little bars on the side where my face is in the middle and the two bars on the left and right side over here. Right here and right here. Um them are usually a different color. But I've changed that to where they're one of my most favorite colors. And for you guys that don't know, my most favorite color is also the color of the day and then this over here. Um, so yeah. My favorite color is green for you guys that don't, don't know. I kind of find, find it ironic in a way because like, green's my favorite color, but my favorite Pokemon are literally orange or red and then blue. You know, the shiny version being more of a greenish color. I'm talking about the second favorite Pokemon for Alligator. Or Totile or Croconaw. I am thinking about one day making a list of all my favorite starter Pokemon, but I'll have to figure out a good time to do it. If I wasn't about to do an episode right now or something else, I would. I do got to let you know something is that this up here is a little bit different. In the settings, there was a different ways you can put the date, and like you can even have the time that it is at the time you're recording. Um. There's like some settings where like you see a date in a weird way where like normally the um where normally like the date's a little bit weirded up where like you can see like this number right here and then this number right here. So instead of saying it instead of it saying 10 13 2019 it says 13 10 2019. I never really understood that date process. I mean it's all right but before the date kind of looking like this. So that it's a lot easier for me to read. Um, as long as they can also see what the different text, like how the text looks a little bit different. I did actually find out a way that you can like change the text font of this, of this webcam. That's why the date looks like that. It's also, you can't see this, but as I'm speaking, the record thing down here, thing that's counting up is actually having that same text font. So like, the number you see up here was like, was like, like the one that's showing on the record button, which is pretty nice. Um, and there was also an option where I can change the time, or like, change it to where we'll show the time along with the date, which I did. The date's about uh, 30 seconds off, but right now it is about 2.30 in the morning. Um, by the microwave clock and the oven clock over here, since it's 2.31, my computer's like, like 40 seconds behind, 30 seconds behind in time. But either way, it's only like a, around 30 seconds off, so like, it ain't the wrong time either. Um, so yeah, to summarize everything, I'm just going to let you know that, uh, there will be no more wheel for this series, and also, like I said, the series might be just wrapping up at one point in time. I don't like wrapping up a series that was going for so, so long, but it's getting to a point where now we don't have anything to do. Like, like, like I said, the only game we really got a lot to do on is that Pony City one. We got a few other games we can do a lot. I like that Dino Factory one. And even while I went off camera a few days ago, I actually did earn myself some new dinosaurs we can raise. By like breeding them, by like breeding other ones and doing all of that. And I also got that one dinosaur that was still sitting in the lab waiting to be sold. Um, out there being sold right now. And I think by the time I get on that game, it'll be ready to be, ready to be out. I still have other games like Pony City on there as well. I mean, not Pony City, um, Pony Land. But it ain't new as good. I mean, it's alright, but like, I prefer other things. That's one, thing's about, that's one thing about all these games I've been doing. There used to be a game, I don't know if they still have it, on the tablet and, I, and stuff like that. That's similar to that Pony Land game, but it's called Dino Land. Instead of raising ponies, you get to raise... You guessed it. <laughs> dinosaurs. One thing I do like about the dinosaurs compared to the ponies is that um, some of them actually grow pretty quickly. Like I said, some of them will grow in five minutes just like the ones over there, like the ponies in the game. But the dinosaurs, there's actually one dinosaur in particular that only takes 15 minutes to grow. And there was a few other games that was kind of similar to that as well. Um, there was a game I had on here a few, like, probably like 
five, ten episodes back that was called Fantastic Fish, where like most of the fish grow like in a matter of five, ten minutes. But like I said, that's it, that that episode or that game got a little bit too boring and I decided to get rid of it. I've been trying to find other games to get going on a series with, but it's gonna be kinda difficult. And that's what I'm saying guys, until Sword and Shield come out, I may not have anything for you to do for you. That's one reason why I'm keep redoing Let's Go PHU and Eevee. Because of the fact that I need something to do for you guys until Sword and Shield come out. And that's got another month left. I do got a little news update that I meant to tell you in the last video. A little news update is that my grandma actually went to GameStop and I guess found like the box cover for one of the games. And she actually paid some money to get one of them games held. That way I can buy it whenever we get there. She couldn't pay for the game, but like she has it held. That way whenever I go to GameStop when it comes out, I can get it. Um... According to Mingma, the store clerk also, or the person at the store also told her that the game will probably cost at least 70 bucks. But one good thing is, I've got over 140 right now. The problem is, if they're, I, I usually like having both copies of the game because I usually, like how with Let's Go Pichu and Eevee, I keep redoing the same game over and over again. I like playing the same game because if the game's fun enough, I want to go back to it. The one reason I keep going about the Let's Go PHU and Eevee is because it's so fun. For as short of a game it is, it's really fun. I like playing it. That's one reason why I keep going to it. Not to mention, that's why I'm trying to... That's why I keep redoing the game for y'all. One thing I definitely add to this series, which you guys already know, is the challenge factor. Which is going to be kind of difficult later on, because like I said, half the challenges I named out in the last video are going to be extremely difficult for me to do. We got lucky in the first episode to basically have a hey a challenge free day because the wheel ended on you can't crush the ice stations during a battle. Which as you remember in the beginning of the episode when we did our first Pokemon battle against our rival, he did paralyze my Eevee. But again, I didn't have anything to clear size conditions yet. So even if I did I wouldn't be able to do it or I felt the challenge. I did also talk about how like I can only follow the challenge if absolutely necessary. I didn't really give very good examples in that episode. Basically what I mean by that is if I need to break a rule in the episode, like break that rule, I will be allowed to do that, but only if it's a desperate need. To y'all this may not sound too bad, but like for me this is like insanely important. One good example is if I need to break a rule is if I have nobody else to take on a gym but that one Pokemon. So let's say that I wasn't allowed to use male Pokemon, as you guys know from my Let's Go Pikachu project, or Let's Go Eevee project, the one I'm doing now, they're mostly male, except for Eevee. So yeah, if I land on that, I may be completely screwed. I'll give you another example. What if later on in the game, I decided to get rid of Eevee's Buzzy Buzz and gave it, gave it for something else? And it was around the time I to take on Erika's gym, or Erika's, I could call her Erika, Erika's gym, the, the grass type gym, and I wasn't allowed to use Charizard. Well, if I got rid of Bouncy Bubble, I mean Buzzy Buzz, oh frick, Sizzly Slide, um... If I was allowed to get rid of that, well, that's not good. Sorry, guys, something happened with the things I'm wearing. Something ripped of mine. Um, so yeah. <laughs> anyway, like I said, if Evie forgot, if I made Evie forget the move, she's like, so I need it. I need somebody for Rika's gym. That would be an exception to where I can break the rule. If, in any scenario, I don't have anybody else to take on the gym, you know. I need to break that rule then. Another good example would be something with the Elite Four. Let's say during the episode where I'm taking on the Elite Four for the first time, I went on a challenge of, you can't buy anything at the Pokemart. Well, um, for the, when I first faced the Elite Four, I usually go to it there to, um, sell all my stuff. And then 
say all the stuff that I don't need, and then buy a bunch of stuff that I know I will need for that specific episode, or for the Elite Four itself. So, aka a bunch of full restores and a bunch of revives. And that, a good example would be is if I, I went on the can't land the Pokemon or can't go to the Pokemon during that episode, I will break that rule. So that way I'll be prepared for the Elite Four, guys. I know it's weird for me to be breaking a rule, but I just want to make sure that like this playthrough goes insanely well. That's one thing I've been kind of thinking about. Not do that's one reason why it took me so long to start the series again, or like with the challenge, because I was so scared that like we get something for like the first or second episode that would really screw us up during the game. And like I said, I did say in the first episode that I could break the rules, but I honestly don't want to break the rules. If absolutely necessary, I will try not to break the rules. But yeah. Anyway, guys, it's been about um 25 minutes. As you know, it's been 26 minutes now. I've talked about way too much. So, I actually ain't going to be using this German ball because we ain't going to be using the iPad at all for this episode. And honestly, I think for, their whole, like for this whole series from now on, we won't be using the iPad. And unless I can think of some other way that I can get some more games on the iPad. I will continue my Pokemon Master series at one point in time as well. I do. I did actually beat that ball that I was having trouble with in the episode last episode, so I can continue the game if I wanted to. I'm just trying to figure out a time to do it. There's a lot of things I want to do for you guys, though. There's a lot of been things I've been wanting to do for myself in the last few, like just today, around the time when my mom and everybody was gone from this house. I actually recorded some of the songs. Of Pokemon from a screen recorder and have it saved in my photos so now if YouTube ever decides to delete my favorite songs from Pokemon they'll be set to go I still got to record I've gotten the Pokemon themes and the Pokemon movie themes already recorded I still gotta get the Pikachu jukebox totally Pokemon themes and the Pokemon ending themes and I'll even add like the Pokemon Christmas bash um, because I really don't use them songs that much, but I still like to have them on there, you know. Um, so anyway, guys, I ain't gonna waste much time for this episode. <laughs> I say that, but it's almost been 30 minutes without me starting anything. I'm gonna go ahead and grab everything and get everything ready to go. My tablet's over there. I just got entering everything I need to enter and bring the stand over here. See y'all in a minute. One more thing I'm gonna let you know of is that if we do, like, if the video's only, like, an hour long and I'm not bored with the series yet or bored with the episode, what I'll do is I'll actually, like, go into the Fish Aquarium game and the, um, Pet Aniba game. One bad thing I do got what you guys know of is that we had a problem with the Fish Aquarium last time because it wouldn't let me, like, buy anything from the pet store and, like, grow them out and do the whole virtual fish tank thing. If we do run out of trouble again, I may have to delete the game and let it reinstall itself. I, I really like the virtual fish tank of that game. And honestly, I would like to do more of the story mode, but I'm fine not doing it as well. So if it messes up, I might just delete the game and like reinstall it or something. Anyway, that's all we got to talk about, and I promise it is. If I talk about something else, it'll be while I'm doing the games. So let me get everything adjusted. See you in a minute, guys. I was going to take that long because it stands right here. Now all I gotta do is enter in stuff on my um, tablet. See you in a second. There we go. I don't want to go on unless you, you know, like I said, this won't be that long of an episode. I want to show you something before you get started. And that something is this. Look, that is not many games. And like I said, this game's going to be completely skipped. Nah, that one. The Pony City one, until I can get a lot of stuff on that. And these th these two games right here are probably going to be the games that's going to hold us up for a longer video. This thing, that pony, pony land game right there could also be the same way, but, like I said, most of the ponies don't grow that fast. One of them does, but that's it. 
kind of like the rest of them, he bought me gems to spit up to get done during that episode. The new game that I'm talking about is actually right here. It's called Dragon Friends Green Witch. I actually got a new account on it, so we should be ready to go. You get to actually raise animals during that game, or raise dragons, but it takes a while. Not as in like time, but it takes more of, um, what would be the word? Like you need to wait a few hours for you to actually get like a dragon. You mainly grow from the beginning. So yeah, I've already, I still I got the tutorial and they're waiting for us to go, and I might actually read that tutorial. So yeah, but for now, guys. Let me go ahead and put this on the stand. Let me, let me do something while I'm here, too. I'm going to make sure I delete the, um, the, um, actually, no, I'm not thinking about deleting the pet Neva data, but again, I forgot that I will get to see them grow once before I do that, so if I didn't, I don't know if I did beforehand, so if I did, great, we should be ready to go. If I didn't, I should grow at least one stage, I believe, as well. So, yeah. Let me go ahead and make adjustments. I think should be ready to go. Alright. I'm going to get my chair also ready, because I guess I need to rest my feet in that. Let me do this. Hold on, guys. You're gonna be hearing the computer moving a lot, so give me a second to get that get that started. Let me move the computer where I need to be, and we'll get started. That may not be the best angle, but it's the best I can think of right now. <sighs> I haven't done a series in a while, so don't blame me. Oh, well, let's see the bunk. The brightness is not all the way up. I might turn all the way up, but I'm gonna turn up a lot more. You can see it. There you go. It might be a little bit too bright, but like I said, if it is, I'll just stop it there. Or I'll go ahead and fix it. I am gonna go ahead and get Ponyland out of the way right now. Because out of all the games, probably the one we ain't gonna do it new as much. The green, green fit, and green. Crap, Dragon's Rain. Irish by the end of the game. That one I downloaded earlier should be fine. I'm not gonna sign in. We well, see, the main thing I hate about this unit is the fact that these are the only ponies that can grow in a five minute time. Otherwise, you have to um, do other things. I am gonna go ahead and with well, me breed. I will actually go ahead and breed these two and get the same kind of pony out of it. I actually kind of hope so because, like I said, I can spend the time uh, doing other stuff like races, which could earn us. And by the way, I said races, not the other word y'all might be thinking I said. I can spend the time. Say it's gonna take five minutes, so what I could do is sit there and just keep racing for a little bit. And maybe, maybe one of why in the world I keep on doing that is because of the fact that I can earn a bunch of stuff, especially gems. Gems can become really potent in this game if I really want to get stuff, especially when I want to grow them. Ponies that take a long time to grow. One reason why I want to, one reason why I keep buying the ponies um, or the ponies that I have now is because of the fact that they're the only ones on this game that grow in five minutes. The rest of them take about an hour to 45 minutes. That's way too long to do on an episode. I'm not sitting there waiting on it. You know? See? 1,000 fire coins just from doing that. See, like I said, I guess there's a lot of stuff to do. Which one's the boy? I'll just sell one of the girls while I'm here. I got two of them. Okay. I'll just sell this one. What's the one I get be a girl now? I'm also gonna go ahead and fill these up.
I'm gonna go and get two of them. I'm gonna try to spread this game out a little bit, but I'm gonna try. I also wanna get some other games done too. How long has this one got? Three minutes. Let's race with the other one, I guess, some stuff. I like how our pony's actually named Dude. I find that insanely weird. I talked about all the stuff I need to talk about in the beginning, so I'm wondering if I don't talk about anything else for the rest of the episode. I didn't get what's that time. I heard pretty close for getting that though. So that wasted about a minute with each one. So I can only do two more races and I have a baby horse ready to go. Okay, we got second that time. I wish you could give me more gems though. That's what I'm mainly trying to aim for is gems. That way if I decide to buy other babies, I can actually breed doing that. Did I get it or no? I did, hey. Still only 104 coins. It gave, gave me more for getting third place a while ago. It's time on 55 seconds. I'm going to do one more and have enough time. Um, two minutes. Let's do it again. Let's try to get first place. I don't know how I got it last time. I was close. There we go, start out better this time. I don't know why I can start out like that the last two times. Went good the first time too, which is this time didn't, or the last two other times didn't. There we go. There we go, 1500 that time. I was gonna hack him in three seconds. This is a boy or a girl, whichever one it is, I'll sell. Why is it walking backwards? Oh, that was weird. Is it a boy or a girl? It's a girl. Let's just sell you since you're the other girl on the thing here. We said I could buy that, but look how it takes 45 minutes just for him. I even buy that one now, but look, five hours. Give me some gosh darn gems, game. Oh, 
I've already chased the pine. Hey, that one get born already. It just now let me know that one or the actual one actual grow or hatch or whatever. <laughs> Five thousand, okay. Yeah, the other one hatched. Oh, it was only a minute after right after about five put up. Are you a boy or a girl? Because you are pretty good. Nope, two girls. Dang it. I don't know why they ain't giving me no dadgum gems. I read any more of those. in one minute so I have enough to do at least one more race. It takes about 45 seconds you to do one race but I don't think it's going to take that long for these. Who knows? We'll see. Or maybe not time to do another one but I still want to be there whenever the animal grows, you know? There we go, three other diamonds. How come we're gonna give me that earlier? I had 21. Oh. So, see, we have enough. We may have back run time. Wow, one of them was bigger than the other one, I think. What is that? The boy or the... Is it the... Oh yeah, that's another girl. We still have about a minute left to do this one, so let's go in. One's fast, it's where it crossed the finish line. Yep, I think that one's fast. We never want to do another one. But we'll go ahead and win.
That was one of the um, areas. Hey, that one looks bigger as a bay for some reason. Of course, it didn't haunt it in Costa. Okay, that one cost one, ain't that bad. He's bigger than that one. Okay. I'm gonna see what. Oh wow, because all the diamonds just to grow. I will go ahead and grow it. There we go. Pretty big of a horse. That's one. Maybe the maybe more. I don't know. No, oh, it's one. Let's see how it's gonna breed these two. Probably another one of those. I only need one diamond. So if I can get win first place in a race or something and get enough diamonds, that'd be great. What's wrong with this one now? I just get one diamond, that'd be great. I want to eat one dag um, gym, that'd be great. I just can't seem to get it though. That might be the last one I can do until that one grows up. I don't know how long. I can't see him because that one's. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Bottom right. There we are. If 
Let's see, what time is it going to... Maybe we come back here at 3.40. What I'll do is I'll go ahead and get off this game for now. And instead of speeding it up since I ain't got enough gems for it, I'll come back here in a few other minutes. Um, we are going to go ahead and do this game. Alright, so I'll come back to some of these other games, but I'm not bored with this yet. This game we actually got a new bunch of dinosaurs we could do, so like, yeah. We may even got another one breeding right now, I can't quite remember. Well, I'm here, I'm also to say I had this one already be sold, and that's going to give us some stuff, including, ooh, we're getting us over 12. I thought we had. Okay, so we can't do anything with that right now. But, uh, yeah, I went ahead. I'm going to go and start making more dinosaurs, but let's see what they're required for the next dinosaur is. The one next to the one we don't have yet. So here's someone we breed. One of them's right there, the little purple one. There's one right there as well. What's the requirement for this one? Oh, build 10 stompies. That one ain't that bad, but for this episode, I'm only going to show off new dinosaurs. Let's see if it'll do that. Yeah. All these over here are new. I went not and it was the one at the beginning right there. I'm gonna go ahead and make this one first. We only make about three or four or about four of them. Oh that's a little bit bright. Let me fix that. That's what I was saying. Hope it wasn't that bright for the I saw that but couldn't get to it because the markers are in my way. Like I said, some of these guys get pretty big and I believe they also make you a lot of money too. That's why I think that's one thing like about these guys they actually make you a good bit of money. So like we can just keep building here some of these again or like get some new ones. While we're here, what's else again? When we got that one, this one be one of the new other ones. Some uh, some of them also take a while. They're one of the newer the newer ones that to take a while, as you can see right there. Hold back to my fence this though it'll be done. It's already halfway done now. Actually it's 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 almost it's actually completely almost done now. Yeah there we go. Let's keep getting new ones. We only make four of them around that, so send our one of the new ones.
ones growing up. Maybe, maybe you three. There we go. Like I said, these guys got to get pretty big, which I like. I'm going to click the X on that before I do anything else, but oh well. That one takes a while. Yeah, yeah. Oh. oh no, angry customer. He wants to see the manager. A customer bars being compliant, the honest word that you put to from you ran away. They do. 
You never found the dinosaur. Let's hope it's living a happy life. Because I was disappointed. I don't have enough money to give him a refund or whatever to say. I give him a new one. If I did, I'd definitely do it, but I don't have enough. There we go. See, that one gets pretty big. That one got, that's probably one of my favorite ones. Just look how big he got from the deck. I'm just that one thing. Honestly, I don't even want the guys. I'll just start growing more and more. He'll be definitely one of them, though. I like him a lot because he's pretty big. You saw he went from like, what? Probably about that big to like that big or something, you know. Nope, I saw that that time. Oh crap, I just got two of the same dinosaurs. He'll probably definitely want to not grow. I like him a lot. This one goes a little more. Is one thousand nine hundred forty without making it go down to red. Young is pretty big too. That one's gonna take a while to take a minute. I could skip, but I don't have enough. I'm just gonna go and work on these two while I wait.
I'm gonna go ahead and do this while I change the prize. There we go. Hey. I didn't see it done. There we go. I don't have enough to buy another one or I would. That's probably what the same thing is to stomp, you know, what's up, you know, uh, looking like this. So. Yep. Once again, if coins are actually buy more than Slither, whatever you call them, the ones that got really big, um, buy more than them.
Okay. I also want to try to research in the t-shirt for like the games they do. No, I don't have any dice for it. Oh wait, I don't have enough. Dang it. <laughs> Bro, I have to wait. I like some of the looks of some of these dinosaurs, but I kind of wish there was, um, I like all these dinosaurs in a way, but, like, I like how that one branch with one actually, like, went really big. We can see the difference between the teenager and the adult here, like, you know? It's done, but I can't send that out just yet. I guess I'll go back and turn that horse and pony so you can make sure we don't miss it. Clock is why we shouldn't be going back in about 10 minutes. I'm trying to because that's when they, that's about the time he grows. Being growing this guy's about to do that right now. Here we go. I had to wait until them things get done before I actually stop to make sure. That's what I need to do. Yep, there they are. I am going to do this game if I actually figure it out because sometimes, sometimes things just don't want to work right. One more. I should have taken the longest one can take longer anyway, so let's. I need to go through this, I don't care.
surprised when the rush began. Oh no, I don't know the game again. You see what I mean now? Oh, okay, there it is. So it only appears whenever you have it like this. Okay. Let's get back to that. Oh, it's going to be away. There we go. Oh wow. Here we go. I think we're finished with this one guys. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and um go back to the points again. I should be missing anything. So I keep growing pretty big. This one I can definitely redeem this game for the edge gets pretty big. See what I mean now? Before I should forget, let's get back in here and see what we got. Let's see what I mean. It's one thing about this game that kind of sucks. It grows in eight minutes. Dear me, we could speed it up by that gun trying to take him out to race again. That would either that that would make it take as long. So anyway, uh, we don't have to gen use gens if we want to, since we only got eight minutes and I'm gonna try to do another game. I don't wanna mess it up. I'm gonna try getting some diamonds out of it.
Where do you got a gift this time? Oh, Rover, was that your name? Thunder, that's a pretty cool name. Whoa, 20 diamonds. Yeah, that's actually pretty cool. I don't even do. Or, uh, we can actually grow this guy if we want to. Yep, got another one of them. Is that an agenda? Wait.
that that one over there is going to grow some of it. Wow, he came out just the right time to be on that 20 second row. Okay, over there, right there. Right there in the corner. There we go. That's all we're going to do since you want me. Uh, I am going to go ahead and do this game next. Once I already did get myself in that count crate and all that, so it shouldn't have to do this crap again. Hopefully not. Uh, So you can grow animals in this, and what's good is you can also zoom in. Kind of think about this one as like a dragon version of the tiny farm we used to do. I can't zoom in right now because of the fact that I gotta get the tutorial. I'm I can, but I want to skip another tutorial. Some of the tutorial is boring, but once you get to start raising animals, that's where the game gets good. That animal, or that dragon right there, was already there, so don't be worrying that one on me. I didn't do that one. I'm gonna show you that. I promise you that. That was supposed to be a tour, guess it didn't get rid of it. This one's at level one. I know if you feed him, he'll start growing. I thought I did to go to a tour though, I guess not. I could have swore it made me do it at one point. But what do I need to be to unlock this? Oh wait. Did all I do is click on it? Lift the curse on the dragon egg. So we'll get a mystery egg and we'll the hatchet. When he level nine first, one at level one. Wait, here we go. Build a farm, plant a tomato. Wake up three hungry. Let me get you something to eat. Give you a special gift. Not eat anything for him because of the curse. Uh, so, the poison. Feed nobody just have to do his quest first. Don't make it rain. Even. Don't be afraid to get a cloud. It's a chance to boost the productivity. So 
see. All that work made me tired. Can you build me a house where I can relax? You said you build me a house then. We win. Here's where we gotta start speeding up stuff. So yeah, we're we'll gonna do that. The red roof stands out too much. The green witch will be a less part right away. I don't game messing about our toilet. I was about to be like, what? Fall tree dragon. The hidden secret of this island. I'll tell you. Her born from. Oh, here's where we can start uh, getting dragons. Or around this, anyway. There we go. We don't got drones right now, but we can breed them later. Ray sheep over three. Here we go. Oh, sheep are hungry. How about food with them? See, here's where the. Now we'll start growing at one point in time. But it's not only noticeable with the dragons, but I think you kind of notice it with the sheep as well. See, there you go. As you can see, he does grow at one point in time. Where'd the other one go? Where'd the other one go? Right there. You can see he does grow and it's a lot more noticeable once you get to the dragons. We don't have none yet though. 
is I'm getting all uh, some web um, um I don't know, he's working on some breed cheap as well which is nice I think it's been Here we go. Well, then I'm going to breed. Let's go hang it. This one accomplished as well. Is not ready yet. Please go a little faster. I must be over six. And now we get we bone with a dragon at one point. I don't know if I want to buy one right now, but we would have to be great. See the wing. That's the a true dress hot in there. That was a dog on a tree. The dog appeared as small. Bright stars. I can feel the magic power. I know magic, um, and it's, it's a little bit weird, but basically it's kind of like evolving in a way. Except like the dog and turns into a whole different kind of like animal itself. Heck, it could become like a dragon dragon itself, which I find kind of weird but cool at the same time. It takes about five minutes, but we can speed up. I'm spelling my job, dog. Pretty cheap. Is the sheep thing done? I think it was thing only took like a minute. And there we are. There he is right there. I've thought about it for a while and come up with a pretty nice like building a pen for the one. Let's see what this thing transforms into. I right? said so it can transform. Do you see what I mean? That dog just transformed into a dragon. It's level one. No. Is that one? These sheep or these animals do grow. You don't know how it takes for each. I think they're mass ages, honestly, like level 10 or something. 
They micro every three holy points, I don't really know. Yeah, they're mats on the stage. I believe they're over 10. They didn't let me feel no more. Now we can do magic on him, too. I was going to take a sheep to grow. Make level seven. I don't know why I was gonna think if I was trying to do certain things though. The island is getting crowded. Is there a way to make it bigger? Here we go. I'm going to go ahead and get her thing completed because I'm trying to get the point where I can start raising your ass. Oh my lord. Hey, can, can, I, can I just do that and leave? It's probably going to make me do something specific before I can actually do what it said basically. I didn't tell me anything specific to do. Oh, there we go. But let me grow that guy now that we've gotten up. I forgot about him even being there. No, I'm not doing that. I'm not uploading a profile picture. Get on my face with that. No. Nope. Well, we'll see. We'll see what this thing turned into. I heard a dog. Oh boy, back the dogs again. Can I actually feed this guy now? I actually can. This guy's actually gonna get pretty big since he's on level one. I'm gonna be his already.
Oh my god. You see what I mean now? They actually get giant, which I like. It's going to take 12 hours on that one there. I'll still need the bottom one. Uh, I need them to love the lightning car. There we go. So now I'm not just just trying to hold our version. No. Dang it, dang it. Oh, yeah. Can't be a meal, can I? Nope. I was ancient man. I want a small space so I can take them out. Oh. 
Oh, I think it comes on. I still like how this one turned out. What I'm gonna do to you. You don't actually have to put up two pictures, do you? I think we, yeah, we do. Hey, we can actually get that egg now. It's all green. Okay, here's where we can breed dragons. Get the egg now. Let's go ahead and get that out of there. Let's just use these. Oh. That's pretty big a dragon. What's this thing but huge or something? <gasps> it's the angel dude. This has a oh freak. Look. Look, this is the best right in the entire game if I remember correctly. And he actually grows pretty big too. I honestly did not expect to get that out of this. Wow. Come back to you and get him back in position on the island. Is 
this guy can actually grow and he gets giant. He's already giant. Look at that. What's insane is he can actually can grow him even more. Man, we could buy something, but I don't have enough. I want to grow these guys. You have enough to buy these guys. Let's go ahead and do it. Not until I can. What other earth guy yeah, we got you now?
guess where am I going to feed them? Hmm. There's one over here, so I'm going to feed him. See, that's what I'm saying with that. There's a dragon that gets pretty big. I'm waiting until I get these guys full gone before I do anything like that. This is full gone before. Let's use magic on you too. They, they grow pretty big, which I like. Dang, when it gets gets really big. He's just trying to, yep, yep, there we are. Pretty good. Oh, I should have done this. Oh, there we go. Excuse me, by the way, for that. I'd 
I got you two minutes. I swore I got him on the team. I don't know if he's going to go, so... Oh, I don't know. That's all I can do right now, actually. I like see this game actually is pretty good. It just hates to get stuff done, especially now that I'm out of coins. And the problem is we're running out of games again. The games I got on here are pretty good, but like they could have been better ones. That's why I keep these two. That way, if we ever run into a problem, but, like I may not have anything else to do, you know. I always make up with this game. Of course, the last few times, we may not be able to make it up with this game if the virtual thing don't work the last time. A few times I've been trying to do what it would work. You'll go into it, but won't you buy a fish? It'll mess up right then. Watch. Watch. See? And it does that. You can't even buy a fish or anything. Fish where I'm gonna, I'm gonna re get it and we do it first. Although I shouldn't have done that because I could have just deleted the data. I didn't think about that. I don't know if I fixed fix it anyway though. Mm -mm. Okay, pretty in. We'll line that one down while I'm going to try doing this one. The reason why I didn't delete it is because of the fact that just because I still have a play file here, we can see the other ones grow. I kind of wish that would go by how many days you missed, because I wish I could think it grew two stages if you waited long enough. Instead of you and stuff. I mean, I like that it's one stage, but I wish they could like, show both of them. That pretty cool. Yeah, we do have some money. Eleven days ago, there you go, Frank Grom.
Why Joseph was down. Hope I said it's down. Al Thomas down. It's done now since I say that. So it's done. Yep, there it is. Let's see if it'll even work this time. See if I can get a virtual fish tank or no. So I probably don't have enough shells anymore. I kept the dang thing I had last time. Maybe it did, maybe it didn't, I don't know. Nope, made 200 shells. Well, crap. Well, I'm into this though. Oh, well. Okay. Although we don't have that many shells now, that's a big problem. Oh, well. This is actually working now. When I say in this mode they cannot die either, the main problem will have, well actually they, don't they drop like money, can, or not, I think they can, I think they do, I know they do in the adventure mode, I don't know if they do it in this one already. Hopefully in this mode they cannot die, so that's a good thing. Well I can get stuff off of this too, boy, I'll have to. See how what in that's difficult. I'm going to go to this guy before I do another one. Let's go on by one more so I can kind of like see the difference in sizes. Yep, and there's the money. Hey, that one grew quick. Don't be dead. Gotta be able to look smaller though.
grow on you, you see. Yeah, there we are, spot they grow that time. I went to virtual fish tank, but I did a normal actual game. Like I said, I like taking care of animals, so, or at least in this, these kind of games I do. And this guy's gonna be big once he goes into that king stage, whatever they call it. Once I get these guys to go, I think I'm gonna go ahead and buy more, since they can't die. There's not really a word about stuff running out of these um, things. So to get pretty big. I think Spot got a little smaller, Copy got a little bit bigger. I don't know how long it takes to the king stage. I wish it didn't take that long, but I understand why it does at the same time. I suppose sometimes if you look at them, um, at random times, like I think sometimes if you look at them, um, like, like little baby ones or whatever, they're like with the dress rolling. There we go. Who was that? Junior. There we go. I can't wait to see when he has been. Oh no, it's just in the hate What happened? Oh, wait, does it not make him disappear? I think it does. Hey, it does. Are they back to baby size or am I just getting joked at look? I think I brought him back to baby size. That kind of sucks. Get out of there, just got him. I don't know, that's weird. Yeah, that man go back to that gun baby so that sucks.
Wait, that one ain't growing. Is the match on growth? Is it all like the game is going down? I want to spend like four pieces of food. I don't think he's gonna grow him back to get rid of him. This wasn't that boss that was cool there. That one ain't growing, that's a problem. I may have to get another one here, I don't know. The is not growing at all, I don't know which one to sell. What say the name if I go in here? I, I think it does, but spot will drop me. He wasn't growing at all anyway. I hope you want to go back to the road and I can tell. There we go, see fish out your groove. Hey, there we go, they're growing.
this is probably one of the big ones in here too. Yeah, that's Oh, there we are. Oh, spot going to the base fish. I'm going to buy a black spot that he got to the right now is the biggest fish. Yep. It's not easy.
to. I want to do at least one map of the adventure before I start. Before I stop them. In this game anyway, I might go back to other ones. Especially that one I didn't to show off. That I haven't needed one. So this all ain't that hard, but if I lose a fish, I might go and buy one. I know one of the problems with this one is they actually, uh, they actually get and they will die if you don't take care of them here. So you gotta be strong, careful. Oh my money, frick, no worries. See, it's better than eat two with them. Drop, drop money, drop it. We're dead. Oh my god. And that one's not big enough to do anything yet.
around what the menu is. Let's see how much. The ceiling trail has got to be done. It's very hurt. If they hurry up, I might let them go. I'll probably go ahead and sell them and get them more going. Get a little more. He's got to be a single big job. Oh, I can't have the old transition. Oh, no, I have another one of these. Drowning in the deep. Your chance to serve a life. There's a commotion outside your factory. Stepping out, you see a man in the river. For help. For mercy. You rode your gun out, out over the, the Turing River. You pull the man out of the water and then you just Well, I see way down there is the end glitch. It has to be a glitch. I don't want to one, so I don't have enough I'm going to have to let all these elements get done.
Terus kan gitu mah di luas Guys, I know I didn't do much, or I did a little bit, not too much. Uh, the video's been three hours. I had people in there, and I don't even want to stop anyway. The next episode will probably either be about Revolution or Let's Go Peach and Evie. I don't know which one yet. So you want to do those? Bye.